on my life. <laughs> Hi everybody! It's Elisha. I am back with an update about my oil pulling. But in case you guys don't know who I am, again, my name is Elisha Albert and I am a personal trainer and health and fitness professional. I have been doing this for a very long time and my goal is to just help and motivate and inspire people to be a healthier and better version of themselves. I also work online helping people to just, again, be healthier, especially for people that can't get to me one-on-one -on -one or face-to-face. -face. Um, having a platform of working online through Facebook and Instagram, it allows me to reach out to even more people and help even more people. So if you guys need help, message me, Elisha.com, Elisha.Albert. But anyway, the video is not about what I do as a fitness. When you message me, you're going to find out. But I'm here to update you guys about who joined. Oh, <laughs> I'm always looking to see if people are asking me questions. But I want to update you guys about my oil pulling. I have been doing this now for 12 days. 12 days days and I have to say this is not bad now I did um, a video on January 4th which was the first day that I did the initial putting the coconut oil in my mouth which was really scary <laughs> but um, ever since then it's like you know just keep doing it but I want to tell you guys that um, what is oil pulling really quick. You could Google to find out more information, but through my research, I have found out it's great for fresh breath, teeth whitening, uh, sensitivity with your teeth and gums. It helps with, what is it called, gingivitis, um, and just overall health. Now, coconut oil um, has been around for hundreds of thousands of years and it's really good for your skin and your hair and for like healing scratches and stuff like that and now who knew it was also great for your mouth and your oral overall health of your gums and stuff like that so I was like you know what let me try it I have nothing to lose um, so I started as I said 12 days ago and what I have noticed is my mouth feels extra clean like crisp kind of a way for lack of a better description of it um, I have purposely eaten like tuna and cucumbers and avocados and chicken and like I've purposely eaten food and I would wait like maybe a couple of minutes for the food to go down my stomach and then I would actually do the procedure of oil pulling and I have been doing it now I have not passed 14 minutes <laughs> Now you're supposed to do it initially, initially for 20 minutes, but if you could do it for five minutes a day, that's fine. But I have been doing it for 10, 12, 13, 14 minutes. I haven't gone past that uh, 13, 14 minute mark. And, um, you know, I would do the procedure, spit it all out. And when I realized, I would floss afterwards, and when I floss, there was no food coming out of my mouth. Like, seriously, you swear I didn't just eat. Like, the actual procedure of the oil pulling would really attach. The oil would attach itself to the food and just let it come out when I spit it out, which is amazing. Like, I've eaten tuna, and I'm like, no tuna is coming out of my teeth. Spinach, kale, you know those suckers stick up in there. And when I floss, nothing would come out my mouth. Like the actual oil pulling really cleansed my teeth and my gums really well. And I've noticed too, when I was flossing, I didn't have a problem with my gums bleeding. It wasn't as sensitive, like my right side of my mouth, my molars back there would be really sensitive when I floss. And I didn't have an issue with that. Like it, it really feels way better. So everything is a positive so far. Like no issues with bleeding gums, no sensitivity, no sensitivity with my teeth, with my gums or anything like that. Um, and my mouth does feel crisp, clean. <laughs> I hope that makes sense. It, it clean, it clean. So Rob, I need a spoon. I'm just going to do a quick demonstration because I know people are probably wondering like how the hell does she do it? So I'm just going to give a really, really quick demonstration. I have been using the Trader Joe's coconut oil. You could use any oil. It ain't gotta be Trader Joe's, but for $5, I'm 
I'm using this oil. So normally I put about this much in my mouth. That's how much I normally put, but this is demonstration. So I'm gonna do less. I already did it for today. Um, so I'm just gonna show you guys with it way less. So all you do, I won't be talking for like 10 seconds. You normally put this much in your mouth and you kind of swish it around for 20 minutes. If you can't do 20 minutes and you do five minutes, do five minutes, don't stress it. So I'm gonna put a little bit less just to demonstrate with you guys. Now you swoosh that around your mouth. I watch YouTube videos, I look at a TV show, I return my inbox messages, I check into my challenge groups, that's what I do. So you swoosh that around your mouth for as long as you can, distract yourself with something. Don't focus on the oil in your mouth because when you do that, you're like, holy shit, I have oil in my mouth. <laughs> you don't wanna swallow it. You always spit it out in a cup. Don't spit it out in a sink. When you're done, rinse your mouth. Spit it out in the cup, floss, and brush your teeth. And you would be like, your mouth will just feel this crisp, amazing feeling. So I'm not seeing any questions. Um, I am going to continue to my 14 days because it is recommended that you do it every day, 10 to 20 minutes for the first two weeks. Michelle, you better try it. Seriously, the initial putting the oil in your mouth is kind of like, oh my God. But after a while, like you just saw, I did it in like two seconds and it, I didn't really feel anything. You want to let it melt. I mean, this coconut oil for me is pretty soft but you want to let it melt in your mouth. So just let it sit there and you kind of crunch it up with your teeth a little bit, let it melt in your mouth, the saliva and the oil mixed together. And then you just squish, squish, squish. Mm -hmm -hmm. You let it sit, mm -hmm -hmm. you let it sit, mm -hmm. you let it sit. Yes, Chantel, it is only coconut oil you're putting in your mouth. You're not putting anything. Now, some people do use olive oil. Some people do use, um, saf is it safflower oil? Is that an oil? I can't remember. I put it in the description. This the the coconut oil, olive oil, and I put it in the description in the other oil. Now some people do put a little bit of peppermint um, essential oils in there just to give that little extra pop in your mouth. You don't have to. I simply just use the coconut oil. And seriously, after I brush and floss my teeth, my mouth feels really fresh and nice. Yeah, you should definitely try it. Everybody, try it. Try it. Try it. Yes, Luca, you should definitely try it. And after 10 to 15 minutes, again, you spit it out in a cup. Don't spit it out in the sink. Don't spit it out in your toilet. You do not want to clog up your drains. Spit it in a cup or spit it inside a garbage bag or in a plastic bag. Rinse your mouth out, spit it in the bag tight, throw it out. Um, and then you brush and floss your teeth and that's it. So again, you do it for 10 to 20 minutes every single day for two weeks. And then after two weeks, you do it two to three times a week for the rest of your life. <laughs> and that's what I plan on doing. Um, no, it wasn't that bad, Luca. Um, and yet, yeah, you do it every single day. Um, I have been doing it midday for the most part. It doesn't really matter if you do it first thing in the morning or at night. Once you do it once a day for 14 days straight, 10 to 20 minutes, if the first two, three times you do it for five minutes, that's fine. For me, as I said, I normally would do it midday. So midday is probably when I'm just doing some extra messages uh, for my clients and stuff that I'm training and helping with weight loss. Or um, if I'm putting out invites for my upcoming challenge group and stuff like that. So I'm distracted. I'm distracted. I'm not thinking about it. Um, and when I look down at my timer, oh, 10 minutes go by. And then I might push for another two, three minutes. And then I spit it out, brush and floss my teeth. And that's it at the end of the day. Um, one thing I must say, it does encourage you to floss and brush your teeth if it's something that you don't normally do because some people don't. 
So I think that's it for the questions. 10 minutes gone by. God, I talk a lot. Um, if you guys have any more questions on it, I'm not an expert. I did my research, Googling, and, you know, just really um, checking out different doctors and stuff and their, um, what is it called? Their blogs, just to figure out, am I going to be sick off of this? And I haven't had any side effects except my teeth feeling really fresh, really clean, and um, it's worked for me so far. I can't tell if my teeth's wider, but you know, it just, it does feel great. Now I'm sure it feels clean because I'm constantly brushing it every day and flossing, which you're supposed to do. But I, as I said, I was doing that before the oil pulling and I would experience a lot of sensitivity in the right side of my mouth and my molars and stuff there. And now I don't experience any sensitivity there and I don't experience any bleeding there. So it, that that's progress because I was flossing and brushing before and I would experience that and now I don't experience that. And again, my mouth does have that crisp feeling to it. So yeah, that's my 12 day update with oil pulling. I tried to list as much benefits below this video. Again, if you guys have any questions, just reach out to me pertaining to this. Um, I would suggest do your research to find out more information about it, but this is my personal experience. And if you guys want to get healthy, it's a new year, y'all. It's 25th, 2016, 2015. It's a new year, <laughs> 2016, and February is in two weeks. So if you guys have been slacking already, Stop slacking, reach out to me. I'm here to help you on your fitness journey if that's what you want. I'm here to help you with oil pulling. Um, thank you so much, guys, for watching. Okay, I'm logging off at the 12 minute mark. <laughs> Bye, guys.